of the Millennials, Dreamers, Undocumented uh, Citizens, and I call them citizens because they contribute to this country, are fearful of voting. So if I vote, will immigration know where I live? Will they come for my family and deport us? Not true. Okay. And the reason is, first of all, when you vote, you are a citizen yourself, and there is not a situation where the voting rolls somehow are transferred over and people start investigating, etc. The sanctity of the vote is strictly confidential in terms of who you voted for. If you have a family member who maybe is undocumented, then you have an even greater reason to vote. Am I the only sober one here? An illegal yeah. immigrant is being encouraged to vote and don't worry about being tossed out? It's outrageous lawlessness, the same stuff we've seen for years. Brian, this Justice Department has been fighting in federal court. My organization has been fighting them. Uh, they're trying to stop citizenship verification and voting. They're doing it all around the country. They are trying to block states from making sure that only citizens are registering and voting. This is a multi-year effort. You're seeing the culmination of it in what President Obama said, because alien voting is critically important to Democrats to win this election. They're doing it in Virginia. Pennsylvania, Colorado, Florida, the Justice Department is standing in the way of preventing this from happening. The President of the United States is telling a reporter to tell their undocumented friends, please vote and don't worry about being tossed out. I'm going to think about that for a second. Now let's bring this into play. You're online to vote and you don't know who you're voting for yet. And then out comes a guy handing you tickets to see the most famous basketball player, maybe the best ever, speak to you for free. Which would, look what Peter Ducey found out when he walked the line and listened to one guy handing out LeBron James tickets. Listen. What is your name, Hillary? LeBron James. Yeah, you're not kidding about this. Give me my name. Oh, that's very nice. Um, are you with the campaign? Are you with the campaign? LeBron and Hillary appearing together for free, handing that to people online, that could sway a vote. Is that allowed? It's a federal felony to give or accept something of value in exchange for a vote. But what do federal felonies matter anymore, Brian? It doesn't matter because the Justice Department won't prosecute it. They know about other federal felonies. They know about alien voting. They know about double voting. We've sent them names of people. They simply won't prosecute voter fraud because it helps them win elections, period. Well, if we had facial recognition uh, identification technology, we'd be able to arrest him, perhaps. And for, for the record, Peter Ducey is cute enough, all right? Just so I want to straighten that out. Thanks so much. Uh, Jay Christian Adams, it's outrageous, but thanks for joining us this morning.